I'm going into Epcot for the Festival of the Arts. Today is the very first day. It is a gorgeous day, windy, cool, the beautiful blue skies and the white clouds. It's a perfect day to go to Epcot. I have all my custom masks from Grape Soda Club and my ears are from Dizzy Whirl Ears and I'm gonna link them below. Look at these ears. She actually painted the cloth and then painted the little Mickey icons on the palette on the front and the back. Are they adorable? Here we go, you guys. Spaceship Earth. There's a new fountain over there, which you're going to see here in a minute. Here is the little Festival of the Arts display, which is a great to have your picture taken out or take your picture out on your own. It's so beautiful and this music. Oh my God, don't you guys wish you were here? I know Disney misses you. And if you're missing a trip, I'm so sorry, but you guys can come soon. Spaceship Earth is a walk on, you guys. I'm going to show you things around the park. Obviously, I'm going to show you festival merchandise. I'm going to get some food. I'm going to show you guys everything. Now, I don't know where all the merchandise locations are going to be. So as I go around, I'll show you guys. I'm sure as usual, they're scattered everywhere. At the different Joffreys around the parks, they have different specialties. So for example, here at Future World East, there's a Starry Night Latte. Actually, that coffee smelled really good. I might need to get some. I was going over here to Mouse Gears though, because I thought we could peek in there first. Maybe I'll check the coffee out when I'm done in here. But you guys grab the popcorn, settle back, get comfy. This is going to be a great video today. Save time with mobile checkout. Now available in the My Disney Experience app. What? Interesting. But I did come in here real quick just to peek and see the festival merchandise so I can tell you guys. Oh yes, I see some over here in the corner by the exit. I'm gonna go to the big store that has everything towards uh, the back of the park to show you everything all at one time. Oh my gosh, look. This is just to give you a sneak peek here of what's to come. And to help you guys if you are coming here and want to know where to find stuff. And if you're not coming here and you just want to come here virtually. So I skipped the coffee, you guys, because it said it was a pairing $9.99 for the coffee and donut. I don't want the donut. They might have the coffee but it was caramel and white chocolate, so I would check out another one instead. That is so cool. <gasps> wow. There's a lot of cool things like this around Disney that you guys can do. The photographer can take pictures for you guys for PhotoPass. Test track, I can see the standby wait time is 45 minutes. I hope you guys are just as excited as I am to see everything today. Oh my God, look, there's a whole section of uh, galleries. Wow. So obviously I can't show you every single thing, but I can show you as much of everything as I can. Wow, it's gorgeous. You can see some of the artists here working. <gasps> He's painting Stitch. place called Decadent Delights and it is for the Festival of the Arts. These are artistic desserts. There's a lot of food and drinks here. Lots of good choices. I'm not going to get anything from here. I just want to share it with you guys though. But I am going into Port of Entry because I do see festival merchandise in here also. I'm going to start showing you guys some details here in the store because it's nice and bright in here. It's so dark in the like merchandise store and plus you know I want to just scatter it in here. So there's these Figma headbands, but they are not festival exclusive. I'm pretty sure they, they were here already. Sometimes if they don't have special ears, so they put some ears that would go, if you know what I mean. But anyway, let's start here with the mugs. Now this has fifth anniversary on it and pretty much Festival of the Arts is always gonna feature Figment because he's extremely artistic. You can see he has a paint bucket and a paintbrush. This is the inside. The handle is uh, shaped like a paintbrush. Well, I mean, a, a bent paintbrush, but it is a paintbrush. 
And the other side says, eat, sleep, art, repeat, at Pop Festival of the Arts. It's weird because am I overlooking the year on there? I don't see 2021 on there, but anyway, it's 1999. And while I'm showing you guys these things, if you want any of them and you're not coming, you can shop at my friend's store, which is yourwwstore.net, and you can use coupon code EDSMAGIC for a free gift. Just have a little patience because um, they're in the middle of trying to get all this stuff on you know so if you don't see it when you're watching this video just check back and check back and check back and it will be there and then you guys can order it but moving on we have a service tumbler now this does have a 2021 uh, year on it fifth anniversary all that i love this color and everything it's 34.99 purple is my favorite so of course i'm gonna obviously love all this stuff i also love this plate but the funny thing is i didn't know it was plastic or melamine um, but I love these kind of plates. I like to use them at home for sandwiches and just for little simple things. Put some pickles on it, you know, use some snacks, some almonds, stuff like that. And then when you're using it, it's really fun because, oh look, it just reminds you of the Festival of Arts or Disney. And it's uh, what I call a practical souvenir, which I, they're my favorite kind. But anyway, it's $12.99 and it is not uh, microwavable, but it looks like it is uh, dishwasherable. <laughs> So there's a spirit jersey, of course. I mean, it's hard to remember the days when there weren't spirit jerseys, but now they are in abundance. Has a, like a stylized figment on there. I love the purple and the orange and the front has the logo with Spaceship Earth on it in the puffy ink. I also love tie-dye. These are, I believe, extra small to two extra large and they're $69.99 each. So I'm gonna show you guys this and it is going to have a little spoiler to it. So basically what this is, it's like a scavenger hunt and you've probably seen these at the Food and Wine. You've seen them, well, lots of different events throughout the year here at Epcot. What it is, is you pay $7.99 for this map uh, with stickers. So here's the sticker sheet in the back, see? It's called Figment's Brush with the Masters. You can do it like a scavenger hunt. You go to each country and when you find the item, you stick the sticker on it. And when you bring it back here, you redeem it for a free gift. So I'm gonna show you the gift. So if you don't wanna see the gift and you wanna be surprised, then you would not wanna see the gift. I'm gonna warn you here in a minute before I show it. But basically you purchase this for $7.99. You do not have to use it. So you could technically buy this for $7.99 and then say, okay, I want this gift and they'll give you the gift and you can keep the map and the stickers and everything unused. It's your choice. So you don't have to worry like if you don't finish it and stuff. But I'm gonna show you guys the gift now. Are you ready? There's four different gifts. You get one, but you get a pick from four as long as they have them. Here we go, guys. If you don't wanna see, close your eyes. So there are these little paper, so cute, little paper characters that you put together out of paper. So there's four, like I said, to choose from. You get one for each map. So if you wanted all four, for sure, it's not a mystery. You can actually pick what you want. Then you had to buy four maps. But anyway, there's Figment, Mickey. They come like this right here, see, on a sheet. And then there's Donald Duck and there's Chip and Dale. And they're really, really cute. There's a keychain. It's a dome, see? It has figment inside. And a little charm it says Festival of the Arts at Pot. And it is $9.99. There is the most adorable t-shirt. Once again, I'm gonna be just extra partial towards this because well, I love pigment and I love purple. But I also like how they designed the characters, it's really cute. Uh, here's the front of it. And let's see if there's anything on the back. Yes, oh, that's adorable, look. I like the placement of that. Oh, I cannot wait to see all of this stuff. This is just a little sample. This is $29.99. I do see here on the rack a small to a three extra large on the shirt. And I think that's all I see right here, right now. So we're gonna keep on looking, keep on moving. So much to be done. I feel like we just got here, we just started, so stay tuned. Okay, we passed Canada, we're almost at the UK. I see another Joffrey's and it is the Canada Creative Twist Latte. So this one's a brown butter toffee syrup and Swiss chocolate syrup topped with Twix. Now that looks good. Once again, I don't want a donut, so I'm gonna go see if you can order the coffee by itself. Okay, you guys, I got it. You can get it without the donut. So it's $9.99 with the donut. I got it with my annual pass discount. It came to $5.10. I got it warm because it's cool outside. So it's not often when I'm out that I get to enjoy warm coffee. So ooh, there it is. So excited, it smells so good. 
So here it is, you guys. It's so delicious looking. I'm hiding in a little corner over here drinking my drink. So I do have my mask off, just warning you guys. Um, like I said, I'm, I'm in a corner. There's no one near me, but uh, you're allowed to take your mask off and drink a drink as long as you're stationary. So that's what I'm doing. But I personally like to be nowhere near anyone else just for my own safety and for other people's safety. But anyway, I just wanna tell you this is amazing. I mean, I know this sounds crazy because I'm here all the time, but I think actually maybe it's not that crazy because if you're here all the time, maybe you don't eat out as much and don't get treats as much because you would do it all the time. And A, it's expensive, it's not healthy, it's, you know, it's not the same. And if you did all the time, it wouldn't be the same maybe. Even though it's not, this, not the situation with Disney. I've been here 11 years now, as of the 9th, and I'm not tired of it at all. But basically, I don't go to Joffrey's. I don't get Joffrey's, but I should more often because this is amazing. This is amazing. Uh, I have to say here, after I keep sipping on this, that this is literally, is going on one of my best coffees that I have, one of my best lattes that I've had. Oh, it hits a spot. It's so nice out here, especially in the shade when it's 60 degrees out. Okay, coffee's done. Right back here in between Canada, right here. There's Canada, there's Joffrey's, and UK. Are these big gates which are usually closed but now they're open because they have a bunch of merchandise in here i think they have food in here too maybe the place that i'm looking for there's this place i'm looking for i gotta get some tomato soup i'll show you guys when i find it so here on your right we have a featured artist wow oh my god this is gorgeous there's also more over here on your left lots and lots of art well it's just everywhere <laughs> That's Larry Dotson over there. Oh, look at that, and there he is. How cool, you can come here, you can get your print signed, you can get their newest things, this is amazing. Over here is uh, some type of food, I'm gonna go look at the sign here in a minute. It's the festival favorite. So you can get Remy's Ratatouille here. There's plenty of places to eat, there's restrooms in here. It's a really cool place, it's where the pin events were held when they had those. Tells you up there where to see festival favorites. The Painter's Palette is right there. If you like steak, come to the Painter's Palette. Oh my goodness, pistachio cake. Okay, so here at the very, 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 very back, they have a little corner of the festival merchandise there. And then they have more artwork. And you can see there's artists signing. They have their stations set up with their art behind them. And they do the signings. That's really, really special. Uh, you can find online the schedule of who's going to be here when and where. Here's a little festival market. We're going to see if there's anything that we haven't seen yet. So here's the hat with a logo on it. has figment on the back. It's $29.99. Oh, I like the inside. And here's the festival logo t-shirt. It is $32.99. This is actually a pass holder limited release artist series. This is a pass holder ornament, you guys. It's plastic. It's $19.99. There's also a magnet. Here's another style of the magnet. The magnets are $14.99. And here's a pass holder phone case. It is $29.99. Here's another style of phone case. Oh, there's a plastic turvis. Oh, it's neat. It's like clear, but tinted orange and purple. And it is uh, $26.99. So there's a bin of posters here. These are $50 each. I'm gonna see if there's a size on them. I don't see a size on it. But anyway, I'm gonna go show you over here on the wall, the poster up close. But ooh, she has pins. Let's look at pins and then look at poster. Okay. So here are the pins. Are these the only pins there are for the yeah, festival? Yes, just okay. these four. And then these are the regular pins for the festival. These are the annual pass holder ones. There's 4,000 of these, 2,000 of these, 2,000 of these, and 4,000 of these. They're so beautiful. That was so neat. Oh my gosh, those are so gorgeous. All of them are just gorgeous. Um, look what's on this stage, you guys. Look, what? This is so cool. Isn't it cool here? I mean, I'm just having this amazing time. And there's no extra cost to get in here. As long as you have a park ticket, you can enjoy the festival. I don't have uh, anything to purchase, so I'm waiting here so I can see the magic bands. I see two different kinds and the, um, to take a picture of the pins up close, like individually for Instagram, which is Disney.shopaholic.official. If you guys want to follow me there, I post updates every single day. There's two different magic bands. This one is a pass holder. And this one is limited edition of 2000. So I made it to France, you guys. <laughs> 
I haven't seen anything else new since I left that building with all the merchandise in it. So I'm going to say I guess that's it for now. I am going to see if I can hop on the friendship boat. I don't know if I'm going to make it. There's so much more food spread out throughout the whole world showcase and up front. Cannot do it all in one day or at least I can't. But I pretty much showed all the festival merchandise. If I find anything else as time goes on, I'll put it on Instagram, DisneyShopaholic.official. And I'll put it on Facebook, Disney Shopaholic. And I have to come back and try some yummy food because that coffee was amazing. Look, there's another festival market. Don't see anything new, except for, well, they have the little wristlet, uh, the little wristlet um, gift cards. They have a little wristlet on them. Anyway, you can get those, those are fun. Oh, this is perfect timing. It looks like I will make it after all. Woohoo! I'm excited, what a fun day, oh my gosh. Thank all of you guys for joining me, as always. Appreciate every one of you guys. I'll see you in another video soon. In the meantime, enjoy this boat ride. Bye.